I've, I've been doing this for quite a few years now and you just couldn't convince me that a machine could do it any more efficiently or faster or, or better, you know, produce better quality than I could. We had changed our molecular typing technique from SSP to SSO. And SSO requires a much purer or cleaner DNA prep. So we decided we wanted to try and look for uh, robotic methods of DNA separation. As far as the size of our lab, I didn't think that we were a, a high enough volume lab to really warrant one either. No matter how well a technologist adhered to the old technique, the uh, column separation technique, they were never able to get reliable consistency within a certain range. We were doing validation for having the automated extractor and I literally took 10 samples and did the extraction using the columns. Took those same 10 samples and did the extraction using the Maxwell and ran them on the very same tray at the very same time, I mean not one minute different, in the very same thermocycler for the SSO typing. And I ran them on the Luminex machine. And when I did, of those samples, four had to be repeated. So I thought, well, let's just see what those automated extracted samples look like. And not one of them had to be repeated. I mean, literally not one. That was for me the epiphany of when I decided that I was not going to be without this machine. By having techniques that allow for semi-automation, it's easier to train new technologists. This is the easiest thing that I have ever trained anybody on. To say that it's self-explanatory is, is an understatement. It's as easy literally as one, two, three. You get the cartridge, you add your sample, you add your plunger, you label your uh, elution tube, you put it in the system, and then Maxwell asks you, do you have your cartridge? Do you have the plunger? Do you have the elution tube? So it's, it's, it's just so easy and, and it makes, it's really and truly the easiest thing to train anybody on for what we do here in the lab. We're not chained to the hood anymore during our extractions. I can set up one extraction or I can set up 16 extractions and I can uh, plate SSP trays from the day before or I can spec DNA that I've already extracted or I can set up SSO typing that needs to be done. I can go on break, I can go to lunch, I can take a phone call, I can go out in the lab and help somebody else. We've been able to streamline the testing that we do, make our testing more efficient, be able to do more testing as a result, but still keep a fairly small staff. What keeps me going here is knowing at the end of the day or after a 20 hour shift having been in, in here on call on Christmas Eve, I know that I'm going home and ha helping somebody have a better quality of life. Um, you know, they may be able to see their grandchildren grow up or they may get to go to their senior prom. I'm here and I'm helping and I'm doing my little part to help somebody else out. That's what, that's what matters to me.